can someone please stop putting a microphone in front of that man's face? Thank you very much. Okay, let's read something childish today, shall we? Last time I did one of these, I read Go the Fuck to Sleep in Gollum's voice. Well, I found another book, children's book, <laughs> that we're going to read today. So let's get right into it, shall we? All right, folks. So it's story time with Gollum again. We're going to read a little old book by the title of Do You Want to Play with My Balls? <laughs> Written by the Cafaldi Brothers, illustrated by Santiago El Hello, do you want to play with my balls? Do ya? <clears throat> sure, Chuck. I can hold your ball sack so it won't drag on the ground. <laughs> wow, your balls are so big, I can't even fit them in my mouth brushes. My mom's always yelling. Hey, Louie, get those balls out your mouth before you choke. You know that mean girl, Sally? She screws my balls so hard they looked funny. Well, that'll, that'll, that'll do it. Ugh, creepy bitch. Yeah, well, when I play with Sally, I always end up with blue balls. Because <laughs> kids know this. Billy Johnson made Sally cry last week, precious. Now that kid's got balls. Balls. Ugh. Oh, jeez, the mouth on her. Not anymore. Yesterday, Sally kicked Billy's ball so hard she lost her one. Oof. Sounds like Sally's a bitch. Sounds like Sally needs to have her the JJ kicked. Mm. Look at the teeth on that kid. Hello, I talk like this. Look, Lurie, your dog is licking my balls. Ugh. Hopefully with peanut butter. Am I right, Billy? Louie, whatever your name is. Let's roll them on Sparky's fur. Girls hurt our balls. You gotta do some manscaping down there, Louie. Come on. Jesus. How you ever gonna get a girl? You know, Chuck, if we show Sally our hairy balls, She'll scream for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Scream all the way to the police station. Uh, why she look like that? Ah. Yeah, but I don't know. I kind of like Sally. I wish she would just play nice with my balls. Now that's an endearing little quality, and he just, he just wants her to play nice with his balls. You know? Yeah, me too. Jesus, that's not even a five head. That's like a 12 head on that kid. God, it's like, mm, it's like my whole head. Hi, Sally. Do you want to play with our balls? Ew, together. You just leave your ball sack on the ground like that, right next to the door. Mm. Why? Sure. But only if I can play with both of your balls at the same time. And they lived happily ever after? V the end. Wow. Okay. Wow. <laughs> That was an emotional roller coaster. I didn't really get much closure though. Did she end up playing with both of their balls? Or what happened with Sally at the end? And who is who is this bitch, right? I mean, like, why are they trying to impress her? She had like one tooth. But uh, then I guess the balls in the mouth that might that might uh, I don't know. I I don't, I don't know, Louie. I feel like you could have done so much better um, than this bitch, but I feel like she's just in it for your sack of balls. Cause I don't think you make any money yet, do you? So really, it's just your balls is the only quality she really can go with at this point. Just go on Tinder, Louie. Go on, go on Match.com and find a better lady for you. For you, Louie. What would your mother think? I, for one, cannot wait for the movie to come out. Particularly if they get either Joseph Gordon-Levitt or Logan Lerman to play Louie. Because this guy will be front and center. <clears throat> that was creepy. That was creepy. But you know what? Whatever. Who cares? This is my channel. I say what I want. Oh, send your chi. Center your chi. There's a lot of chi going on because you're humongously fat. Anyway, if you enjoyed, you know the drill. Please subscribe. 
please share this video with your friends and family who may or may not have dirty minds in their headicles, headsicles, in their headsicle. Made it up right now, that's a new word. Get that shit done. Like the video, leave a hateful, horrible comment down below if you want to because I enjoy them. Stay safe out there, keep your distance, folks. I feel like you're really close to me right now. You're smothering me, you're definitely less than six feet away. Call the cops on you. <laughs> I love you guys, just kidding. Okay, well, see you later.